Howdy folks, it's the 5th of July and here we are in a hot summery afternoon and we have discovered that we have blossom end rot on a few of our tomato varieties and it tends to be the ones that are like the mushroom type, mushroom basket and also we have an orange um, accordion type where the, um, the actual fruit itself has some, I'll peel one off here, where the fruit itself has um, it's it's fluted. It's like a, an accordion-like shape with all these uh, all these indentations running down vertically. And uh, we've had good luck with the mushroom basket in the past, but this year we discovered that it's starting to take on this blossom end rot. And earlier we mixed up out of some vitamin supplements, which mainly consist of calcium citrate. We ground them up in a blender and mixed them up in this jar, which looks a lot like milk. And what I'm going to do is pour this into our, um, our watering can. And then just use it all up. And then I'm going to go around the root system of all the tomatoes, not just the ones with the... Um, with the blossom end rot, so it's a little bit of treatment and prevention here. And water in at the base, right where the plant comes out of the ground. Oh. Okay, so now we're gonna take our milk-like substance, and you see we're, we're using the red mulch. If y'all are interested in that, we have an article about it. And um, it seems to really help tomatoes, but I'm gonna drench this whole area with this white, milky, liquid right in the root zone. All right, so we treated all of the tomato plants with the drenching of the white calcium solution. Then we proceeded to remove all of the affected tomatoes, even some like these that show just a trace of the effects of the blossom end rot. We hope this has been a good instructional video for you. We'd love to hear your comments and also your experiences that you've had with this situation. Thank you. For GardenSoul.com, Coleman Alderson.